This is an oddity I thought you might find interesting. It's from a Toshiba. Uh, it's before the LED projectors, uh, the digital projectors. This was a regular bulb projector, and this was an accessory. Um, this is the receiver, and this is the transmitter. And what you could do is you could use this to control the image on the screen. But what I also found is that I can plug this into my computer, and I can also use it as a digital mouse. So, uh, if this is something, if you can find it in a junk pile or whatever, might be useful to you. Okay, let's take a look and see what it does. I've got this IR receiver up here. It just normally plugs into your USB port and you wouldn't have it up here like this. Uh, I just put it up there so you can see it on camera. But uh, this is the remote and all you have to do is have this receiver so that the remote can hit it. Uh, up here are the projector functions. That won't do you much good unless you have the projector. Down here are the mouse functions, the mouse wheel, the direction, and so forth. There's some more mouse functions down here. Uh, this also has a laser pointer. I don't know if we can see it on camera. Yeah, there we go. has a laser pointer in it. I don't know if that's of, of interest. Uh, but, uh, yeah, this will do most of the functions of the mouse. And let's uh, do that. I've made my mouse pointer ridiculously large. You can, of course, you know, just any mouse pointer setting, uh, you can speed it up, slow it down, big or small, or whatever mouse uh, uh, icon you want to use. And I'll just be pushing on this inner wheel. Um, so as you can see, it'll go left, right, up, down. And depending on how hard I push it, it goes faster and slower. So, yeah, that's about it. I mean, uh, it's uh, just a remote mouse, uh, and if you can find one junk uh, somewhere, uh, might be well worth having if uh, you need remote mouse function. Okay, well that was it. I hope you found it useful and interesting in your home computer projects.